Lay. Sir. Yeah. Yeah. Kane is in the building. Nigga. Yeah. It's alright. Already the show goes on all night. Till uh. the morning we dream so long. Anybody ever wonder when they would see the thunder? Just remember when you come to the show. What's up? Ram TV. Hey Sydney, did you hear about Lance Armstrong and the Live Strong charity? No, I haven't heard about that yet. Well, Lance Armstrong, a man that won seven consecutive Tour de France titles, announced Wednesday that he's stepping down as chairman of his cancer fighting charity so it can focus more on its mission instead of its founder's problems. He actually created the foundation in 97 and it raised over 500 million dollars since then. Armstrong, who is a cancer survivor, will stay on the charity's board. Well, hopefully someone that's equally as great of a person as he is will take it, take it over for him. I'm sure they'll be fine. Yeah, well, now for this week's announcements. First off, we want to say that we hope all sophomores and juniors try their hardest on their PSATs this week. And need some fun before the game Friday? Well, all DECA members are invited to bring yourself and one friend to the DECA tailgate party today at 5 to 7 p.m. before the game if you are SVP to Mrs. Merritt or Mr. O'Keefe. Sounds like fun. Well, on October 23rd, there will be an informational meeting in the GHS Theater at 7 p.m. Any parents or students who want information concerning the upcoming season should attend. Retakes for the Gwinnett County Gateway Test will be October 23rd and 24th. Passing these tests is a requirement for graduation in Gwinnett County. Now it is time for our commercial break. We will be right back after these messages. Hey guys, it's Sydney and Tahara from Ram TV. And as you all know, the 2012 presidential elections are in full effect. Of course, not everyone is able to vote, but there are so many things that you can do to get involved. You can volunteer at poll sites, campaign for your favorite candidate, and make sure your parents go out and vote. Remember guys, every vote counts. Give us as teens a voice in politics. You can register at any public library, church, or even online from now until October 22nd. So be at the polls on November 6th to either vote or volunteer for your United States president. Everyone has a voice and every vote counts. Bye, Bye Grayson. Summer's gone too soon. Hey Grayson, it's your girl Imani here with your fat of the week. Did you know that if you drink a bottle of water before you eat or drink anything else when you wake up in the morning, it helps your organs to run more efficiently? That's cool, right? I think so too. All right, have a good day. Welcome back to Ramtastic Fashion. I'm Kids is Great, and that's my new co-host, Erica Lewis. Today we'll be talking about our favorite store, H&M. Yup, the Man Fall collection just came out. Oh, how do you like it? Like? That's not even the word. I love the new collection and the website. Website? Yeah. If you go on H&M.com and click on the Fall Fashion Collection 2012, you can have an interactive experience and create your own style. What do you mean create your own style? Telling you won't help. Let me just show you. So what's your favorite thing from the new collection? The cardigans. They're warm, they'll keep you warm and they're very stylish and a preppy look and they only cost like 95. Oh, they also have ladies knitwear, buy one get one free, with shirt prices starting at only $9.95. Pants start at $29.95 and jeans start at $49.95. That's what I love most about H&M. They have classy trends at very affordable prices. Yeah, I agree with you. Also, Lucky Magazine has developed a fall trend report with the favorite stylish pick exclusively by four stylish bloggers. You can also enter for a chance to win a $1,000 shopping spree at H&M. So sign up online for your chance to win. And if you do win, make sure to hit me up. Alright, before we leave, we want to thank at Def Helen Crew and Jesse Grimman for mentioning us their pictures from Homecoming. They all look beautiful. Alright, that's all we got for this week edition of Ramtastic Fashion. Don't forget to tweet us your 
Tweet us at hashtag RamTV and leave us a comment and ideas. I'm Erica and that's Jesus. See you next time. cell phone has an 18% slower reaction rate when faced with the emergency. Over 6,000 deaths and half a million injuries are caused by distracted drivers every year. Teen when another teenage passenger in the car can double their chances of a fatal car accident while two or more passengers can almost make your accident five times as more likely. It not only affects you, but it affects your friends and family as well. Pledge to not text and drive. Save your life as well as others. Davey and Sydney are doing the news this week, but we have some more up-to-date information for you guys. The one-act musical Pippin will be performed in the main theater today at 3 p.m. and tomorrow at 7 p.m. The tickets are only $5, so students, make sure you're able to catch a show. Also, come support your Golden Rams competition cheerleaders this Saturday in the Fear to Cheer competition at Loganville High School. They'll be defending their title as region champs. And if you can't make it on Saturday, then make sure to drop by Zaxby's on Tuesday, October 23rd, to support your Golden Rams from their spirit night from 5 to 9. Sounds great. And also on Tuesday, don't forget about that senior meeting during advisement where representatives from Georgia Southern will be giving you more information about the school and answering any questions you may have. I'm David. And I'm Allison. And that was your breaking news this week. Hey guys, it's Jenny back on your block with your weekend weather. Lately, I've been noticing a small decline in the weather pattern. Maybe this year we might have some snow. Let's hope. Since it's fall, we've been having a few showers, but don't worry, this weekend there's no signs. Today the high will be in the 70s and the low will be in the 40s. Somehow on Saturday the temperature will be pretty constant with today's. I suggest going to a haunted house or taking a walk around the park. As for Sunday, the temperature will be in the high 70s and in the low 40s. It's a great day to hang out with your family, maybe brunch at your favorite place or walking and visiting your old pals. Well, see you guys next time with another weather report. Have a great day, Grace. Hi guys, I'm China. And it's your boy Landon. And welcome back to another episode of Let's Talk Sports. Volleyball Lady Rams. I hope you enjoyed the slideshow. I guess it was their motivation because they qualified for state. I hope you guys came out to cheer them on in the first round of the playoffs. But guess what? The softball team made it to the second round of the playoffs. Wow, the Rams are doing a bit. Yep, the football team plays at South Bend today at 7.30. Isn't South there rival? Yeah, it is. So green out. Bring your white towels to rally the Rams against the Commons. If you want to see a good game, bring your friends. Your family. Or your girl tonight for some entertainment. Here is a word from the coach. Hello, Grayson High School. My name is Coach Khan. I'm the head football coach here at Grayson High School. We got a huge region football game tonight against South Gwinnett, and we're going to need all of you there. We're going to need the 12th man there screaming, yelling, having a great time, making a lot of noise, trying to make it tough on those comments. So come on out tonight and support your Grayson football team. I hope to see you guys at the game tonight. Speaking of football, the ninth grade football team played Cedar Grove High School in the championships. Oh, for real? They're that good? Yep, they sure are, and they won. Congratulations. But it's that time for tennis stars to shine. That's right. Any students interested in playing tennis this year need to meet in Coach Foreman's room after school on Thursday the 18th. There will be a meeting regarding the season and preconditioning information. If you're unable to attend this meeting, stop by Coach Foreman's room or Coach Jackson's room on Thursday or Friday to pick up information. That is all for today. I'm China. And I'm Landon. Have a great day. Go Grayson.
I'm Mehmet. I'm Jen. And this is your Geek Minute. Do you like Super Smash Brothers but don't care about the inclusion of Nintendo characters? Then PlayStation All-Stars Battle Royale is for you. It plays very similarly to Super Smash Brothers, though there are a couple of subtle differences, such as the Super System. Its roster of 20 playable characters contains old school icons like Sweet Tooth and Parappa the Rappa, more recent mascots like Nathan Drake, Sackboy, and Cole McGrath, and even a few characters from non-Sony exclusive franchises like Bioshock's Big Daddy and Tekken's Hayachi Miyashima. Also, the stages in which you fight are mashups of your favorite franchises, from God of War clashing with Patapon to Uncharted 3 clashing with Bioshock Infinite. And while the game releases this November 20th, you can now download the beta if you're a PlayStation Plus member, and next week if you're not a member yet. I just downloaded the beta myself, and I'm really excited to get to it as soon as I get home. Very excited. The game hit store shelves on PlayStation 3 and PlayStation Vita this November 20th. So go pick it up. So far, a lot of people are kind of disappointed with the game lineup for the PS Vita. Not a lot of great games have been released, which leads to not a lot of people buying the Vita. However, Ragnarok Odyssey might be the game to change the minds of the people. Ragnarok Odyssey is an adventure-based RPG based off the MMORPG Ragnarok Online. You'll be able to play as classes like Warrior, Assassin, and Mage. The game comes with an online co-op feature so that you won't have to play by your lonesome self. The game plays a lot like Monster Hunter, so the game can hold over Monster Hunter fans that are waiting for the next title. The game is set to release in America on October 30th. Well, that's about it for this week. We'll see you next week. Bye. And welcome to the awesome segment that we call Tech Talk. Nice, Duke. Now this week, we're going to talk about laptops. Oh, you mean like this one right here? Yes, Duke, like that. So our friend here actually has one of the best laptops out today with him. Yes, this laptop is the Retina Display MacBook Pro. It's dominated with this beautiful Retina Display. It's very thin and it has very up-to-date components with a quad-core i7 processor, solid-state storage, and up to 16 gigabytes of RAM. Yes, yes, Duke. We all know you're a giant Apple fan. But this laptop is like super expensive and Pizza Hut just isn't paying the bills like that. Well, all right, Nick. Then what laptop would you suggest to the general people out there? I would suggest the Sony VAIO E15. It's cheaper, it works, and like anything Sony makes, it does what it was made to do. Provide a good experience. Okay, so with the uh, whole PlayStation versus Xbox argument, you're with PlayStation, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, I actually am. But let's leave all that video game talk to Geek Minute. Well, all right, Nick. Well, guys, I'm sure you'll be glad to know that next week, the subject will be tablets. Android's going to win that one, right, Duke? Yeah, sure. <laughs> See you guys. See ya. Hey, guys. I'm Imani Kimbrough here with Kaylin Hawkins, senior who's trying out for the Grayson basketball team. So, how's the team looking this year? Well, we look pretty strong so far on workouts, and um, we got a couple transfers that should help the team out this year. Also with a new uh, coach, Coach Pierce. And um, we got a good chemistry so far too also. So yeah, that's pretty much it for that. That's good. So what position do you play? play point guard. I've been playing varsity since a sophomore. And uh, yeah, it's my first year at Grayson. I plan on helping the team out this year. So what are your strengths on the My strength is like passing and getting the team involved. I mean, I score a little bit, but that's not really my game. And um, I'm good at like, you know, making the crowd get involved, like crossover and stuff like that. Who is your favorite basketball player and why? Kobe Bryant. And I want to say Jeff T too, but Kobe Bryant is like overall better. Cause I mean, his mentality is like, I look up to it or so something like that. All right. Thank you, Grayson. Oh, What's up, Grayson? I'm Colin. And I'm Denzel, and welcome to Grayson Style. Yeah, we changed the name from Grayson Street Talk to just like Grayson Style. There's too many talks on this show. So we'll be still bringing you the dancing that you like. Oh,
music videos, shorts, and spoofs. This week is our first music video of we release in One Direction. Yeah, One Direction is a new thing all the way from the UK. It appeared on the UK's X Factor and came in third place. Yeah, if you haven't heard of One Direction, you've been under a rock this past year. Well, yeah. Well, here's what makes you beautiful, but grace and style. You're insecure, don't know what for You're turning heads when you walk through the door Don't need makeup to cover up Being the way that you are is enough Everyone else in the room can see it Everyone else but you oh. Baby, you light up my world like nobody else do Well, we hope you like it, Grayson. And that's all we have for you today. Remember to tweet us at hashtag RamTV. Yeah, what do you want? More music videos? Do you want some shorts or some spoofs? Just tell us. Remember, that's hashtag RamTV. All right, we'll see you next time. <laughs> Hi, and welcome back. Hey, Sydney, did you go to the senior breakfast Wednesday? No, silly, I don't go to this school. Uh, well, let's just put it this way. Our senior class is going to be remembered. Brookwood senior class, not Grayson senior class. Yeah, I don't think so. But <laughs> let's say the class of 2013 is going to be the class talked about for years to come. Yeah, we were a pretty amazing class. Well, this concludes this week's episode of Ram TV. But before we go, here is a presentation from DECA. Bye. Bye. Are you looking for a passion you can thrive on? We are DECA. We thrive on success. On hard work. And having fun. We are the next generation of leaders. Leaders who excel in school. Give back to the community. And are ready for college and careers. If you're ready to find your passion and thrive on success, then contact your DECA advisor today. You should join DECA because it's going to change your life. Are you ready? 